Just, where are the kids? What happened to all the kids? I remember there was 49 kids reg uh, that weren't registered to go back to school. By October, a month later, I don't know how it happened, but the news report started coming out that there was 500 kids that haven't reported back to school. Now, on our end here, everyone says, oh, if, you, if you're reading the reports, it's saying more than 100 dead. For some reason, they don't want to get that 100 count up higher than what it really is. In Lahaina, here on the west side, you, we can guarantee you that's going to be 500 to 700 dead. Now, 500 kids haven't showed up. Where are they? They haven't contacted their parents. They haven't done it. Nobody knows where these kids are, and nobody knows where their parents are. You had multi-generational families that perished in their home, and that's it. There goes the record. Who's going to say, oh, my God, my son is missing? I could throw up. I mean, it's, it's, the counts are way off. No one's giving you an accurate count. You're not even allowed to question it still. Pelletier, Chief Pelletier, MPD, um, news agencies and news reporters want to talk to them and everything. First off, if you're not a Hawaii news media, they're not going to even talk to you. They're not even going to respond to your email. They'll give you like the public, just ignore like, oh, you can get your information from here. But if you're Hawaii news media, and you're trying to talk, talk to uh, Chief Pelletier about anything in Maui, he'll literally tell you right off the bat, we are not talking about the Lahaina virus. Let's move on. For some reason, no one wants to talk about it. They're all avoiding it. They're all ignoring it. You're not allowed to report on it. You're not allowed to ask questions about it. And they're definitely not going to talk about it. The counts are forever going to be like this. We're never going to have an accurate account because they're never going to give us one.